Hello friends, many students wanted to study one year calipers. So, in this video, we will discuss about one year caliper and how to take measurements. French mathematician Pierre Vernier has invented one year caliper in 1631. This device can measure length, thickness and diameter precisely or correctly. It can measure length correct up to 0.01 cm or 0.1 mm. That means least count of vernier calipers is 0.1 mm or 0.01 cm. Vernier scale is the combination of two scales. First is the fixed scale that is main scale. It is called as main scale. Second scale is the sliding scale. This one it is called as vernier scale. Main scale it is marked in centimeters. That means from here to here it is 1 centimeter and this one is 2 centimeter, 3 centimeter, 4 centimeter and so on. The length of smallest division that means this length from here to here. So length of smallest division on the main scale is 1 millimeter. And this one, one year scale which can slide on the main scale, it is joined with the main scale with this screw. One year scale has number of divisions. Most of the one year scale like this one has 10 divisions on it. But some other one year scales also have 20 divisions on it. One year scale can slide over the main scale. That's why this device is also called as sliding caliper. With vernier caliper, we can measure length and thickness of any object, external diameter of sphere and cylinder, internal diameter of hollow cylinder, and also internal depth of hollow cylinder. Let me show you how. There are two lower jaws on the vernier caliper. One is connected to main scale and the other is connected to vernier scale. We put the object between parallel sides of the jaws and then we can measure the external diameter of a sphere. We can also measure external diameter of a hollow cylinder using these two lower jaws. And then there are two upper jaws. One is connected with main scale and the other is connected with the vernier scale. We put the object around these two parallel sides and then we can measure internal diameter of a hollow cylinder. There is a long thin stripe which is connected to the back side of vernier caliper. It is used to measure the depth of a hollow cylinder. Next is least count. Least count of vernier caliper is the smallest value that we can measure from this device. Least count is marked in some vernier calipers. Here in this vernier caliper, this is the least count. 0.05 millimeter is the least count of this vernier caliper. But if least count is not given on the vernier caliper, then we need to calculate it by using least count formula. So for that, first of all, we need to find out value of one main scale division. I told you the value of one main scale division is one millimeter. So it is one millimeter. Then find out total number of divisions on one year scale. This one year scale has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 8, 9, 10 divisions. So just plug in the values in the formula of least count that is value of 1 main scale division 1 millimeter divided by total number of divisions on vernier scale that is 10. So the least count of vernier scale would be 0 0.1 millimeter. We can also convert this value into centimeter for that we need to divide this number by 10 which will give us 0 0.01 
centimeter. So both are the least count of this vernier caliper. I hope you understand this topic here. In the following videos, we will discuss zero error and how to take measurements from vernier caliper. Don't forget to subscribe for daily updates. If you have any questions, you can ask your question in the comment box given below. Thank you.